looking at the clock, 25 minutes, I'll see you then. Great stuff, looking forward to it, Sam. Now, gale force winds are battering parts of the United Kingdom. More than 40 flood warnings are in place because of treacherous conditions which have left thousands of people without electricity. In the Republic of Ireland, a woman died when a tree fell on her car. Richard Lester reports. This debris is all that remains of a train station roof in Cork, which caught the full force of this winter storm. Three people were injured here as the winds whipped in from the Atlantic at speeds of up to 90 miles an hour. The storm swept up through Ireland and into the UK as far as the Western Isles of Scotland. Few parts of the British Isles were untouched, but the most serious consequence was in North Lincolnshire where a cargo ship deckhand fell overboard and still hasn't been found. In Northern Ireland, powerful gusts brought down chimneys and power lines. At one point, 7,000 homes had no electricity, though engineers have now restored power to most homes. Thousands in Cumbria were also cut off. In southwest England, the problem was flooding, and people across the region are being warned to take immediate action. This was Bristol. But Cardiff looked much the same, and in parts of Wales it was an anxious night, with sandbags at doorways and the fire service in the street pumping out standing water. And the Met Office says more weather like this is on the way. Richard Lister, BBC News.